Hi everyone, I'm Petra and welcome back to Primary Tutor Scotland. In today's video, I'm going to be telling you how we support our pupils with additional support needs. First up is dyslexia. As professionals, we have been on a number of courses through our schools or through our local authorities in order to better our knowledge to support children with additional support needs such as dyslexia. And because of this, we put forward our strategies that we do in the classroom and then we put them into our online tutoring to support your child. This might be working on their letter or number reversals. It could be with their reading strategies and also their spelling strategies. The pupils that we have at Primary Tutor Scotland with dyslexia have improved greatly, so much so that their classroom teachers have even mentioned it. Next up is dyscalculia. Again, as teachers, we come into contact with dyscalculia often and we know what to do. So every child with an additional support need such as dyscalculia will have different needs to maybe their friend with the same additional support need. Your tutor will get to know the child so well and identify very quickly what it is that they will need to work on and also methods and strategies that will support them. Teaching numeracy and maths is actually excellent online. There are so many different interactive games, activities and strategies that we can use that we can then send you and your child the resources to then also practice at home. The children that we have at Primary Tutor Scotland with dyscalculia have improved immensely, not only in their confidence, but also in their learning. The third additional support need that we're going to talk about is EAL. That is English as an additional language. So as teachers, we're getting a lot more children into our classrooms who have English as an additional language. That is, it is not their first language. This is something that as teachers we are put on lots of training courses by our schools and local authorities in order to support these children and also to complete our own professional reading. A lot of our tutors have profound experience in working with children who are EAL. There are lots of things that we can do to support these children. For literacy, it's going to be about their vocabulary and their spelling and getting to know the English sounds which can be very tricky. The fourth additional support need that we're going to be talking about is autism. And again, you guessed it, as teachers we see this every single day. And every single child with autism is completely different, with different triggers, different needs and different strategies. If your child has autism, that is something to talk to your tutor about beforehand. Do they have something that they can play with to help them concentrate? For example, a poppet or some sort of play putty that's going to help them when they can get overwhelmed. Because our sessions are online and one-to-one, -one, we can go at the child's pace. And that often is a huge benefit to children with autism. Having high quality one-to-one -one tutoring really helps children with autism. They don't have the same distractions that they would have in the classroom, such as noise and not having enough thinking time. Having one-to-one -one support means that we can go at your child's own pace and they won't feel pressured and they won't feel like it's going to trigger their emotions. At request, we can also offer one-to-one -one health and wellbeing sessions to help prepare your child for tutoring, to get them into that mindset and almost like a transition period. In this health and wellbeing session, we can use bespoke materials to help your child get ready for their tutoring journey. And the fifth additional support need that we're going to be talking about is ADHD. Again, as teachers, we come into contact with children with ADHD every single day and we know how to support them. Again, they might have a fidget toy that they like to play with, they might have a strategy in school that works for them that they want to bring into tutoring. But the fact that it's a small contained one-to-one -one time with the tutor means that the child is much more able to focus and then succeed and learn. And it's great because then they know they can do it, they can learn and it just pushes their confidence on which then increases the progress. If you have any questions about how we can support your child who may have an additional support need, please send us an email or drop us a message on Facebook. We would love to hear from you.